Oops. Model, actress, girl that posts videos <laughs> now on <laughs> We're a girl band. We're coming out with an EP. It's a Christmas album. <laughs> Should we give them a little I preview? I wish. Rockin' around, around the Christmas, Christmas tree. The Christmas tree. Yeah. Yeah. Hey guys, it's Haley here, and I'm joined today with Tati Hi. and Olivia. Hi. I'm gonna link both of their Instagrams and YouTube down below. Check them out. We filmed two Q and A's on their channels too. So I asked you guys to ask us questions all about living in LA, the social media life, like what happens behind the scenes. Yeah. Behind the camera, what happens at YouTube parties? Like, not that I get invited to any of them, but <laughs> we're about tea. to spill the, the whole tray, the whole tray of tea and beans and coffee. And what if I just spilled this on your wife? I would have been like, ah. oh my god, god Becky, Becky, look, look at, at her, her butt. Two two now she want a photo. You already know that she wants as a model. Yellow. Without further ado, let's get started. Best thing about living in LA? Wow. You don't even live here. You're like happy. <laughs> All right, thank you. Um, go subscribe to my channel. <laughs> Bye. I live in LA for like a good one fourth of the year. Yeah. <laughs> my favorite thing about living in LA is the fact that like everything is here and you feel like you're on vacation all the time. Like driving down Cannon or like Palm Drive, I like, Ooh, yeah. I'm like, oh my God. That's like, so true. I'm like, this is my life. Like it's kind of like. Oh. I think my favorite thing is actually like how you can Everyone's so easily like go out and like eat healthy stuff here and like work out and just do fun stuff. You know? Everyone yeah. is here like because they have like a reason to be here, you know? Like everyone yeah, exactly. like wants to be an actor. Or, a model or something like they're really passionate about or it's just like inspiring because like that yeah. energy like reflects off of you too and mm -hmm. it's like a city that just keeps going so you're like always doing stuff so wow. wow we got so serious <laughs> so LA how to jump start a career in the social slash entertainment industry jump, jump starting, starting is jump not starting. really no a it thing. takes a yeah. while unless you're like bad baby like maybe go on the Dr. Yeah. Phil show try to do something else no, 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 not, not something else other than social media. I mean, try to do something else. <laughs> Just don't. We don't even want you here. <laughs> no. I mean, like, do something that people aren't doing a lot. Yeah. Like, either edit your videos differently or, like, make other content that, like, somehow pulls people in or just... Yeah, I feel like the only way you can jumpstart is by, like, being different than everyone you're on the same like level, level with. with. Yeah. And like also I feel like just be yourself. Mm -hmm. Like don't try and be like another person or like edit your videos exactly like another person or just copy that person because like they're already subscribed to that person. Like they're not gonna subscribe to a clone of that person. If just can... join team ten. <laughs> <laughs> Tips on modeling, taking pictures. Taking pictures? Okay. Well That's for the actual Take pictures from below because you look taller. Yeah. And by below, I don't mean like under chin. No, I mean like, like, like from like, like get that down angle. down on the ground. Like get close like to this, the ground. Like this and you're like. I'd say like find, try to find some poses that like work for you and like work with them. Like Olivia puts her hand on her face. I always am like touching my face. And it works. It works. What do you say? Um, lighting. Yeah, lighting. lighting. Have that sun on your Get face. Get that golden hour sun on your face. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then kind of like shade it and you're like, ooh. <laughs> and like a little bit of like that diffused like that. light. Mm -hmm. Diffused. Do you think LA changed your mindset at all? Haley is a lot more of a bitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Definitely, because like yeah. moving here, I like didn't know anything. Like I was like a little innocent little baby. Being here, like you, you're surrounded by so many like different mindset, mindset, mindsets. Do you smell people's? Yeah, minds? I go. <laughs> <laughs> you actually smell like smell really good. good. That's my mindset. Oh. <laughs> What's mine? It's my mind. <laughs> I feel like it's definitely changed my mindset. Just like makes me want to work harder because I see so many people out here who are working super, super hard, and I'm like, literally, the only thing stopping me is myself from working that hard. So I'm like, let's do it. And like, there's so much like judgment going on around here. Like, for me, like, I used to be very self conscious and really affected by like what people used to say. Mm -hmm. And then moving here, you're constantly judged 24 7. And like, once you realize that, you're, you're like, oh, it doesn't even matter. Like, yeah. you're just it, like, it's um, literally like yeah. a thing. Like, that's really true. Doesn't you don't even get affected by it anymore. You're like, oh, like I don't care. Like literally, I literally love myself way too much to let like what you say. Like, and, like when you're walking down the street, there's so many types of people. Like people with green hair, like people with seven million piercings on their face. Like, and it's not even a weird thing. Cause no. like it's LA. That's just the norm here. Like being different is the norm. 
And like, once you realize that, you feel so much better about yourself. I used to care a lot, like if I would go to an event or something, if like other creators or just people were like looking at you all weird. And then I like realized that we're all just like, we're all, all trying to do the same thing. I know, we're all just people. trying to like, what? Why would I care so much about so and so like liking my outfits? Like, no. Is it's life in LA expensive? Yeah. It can. Like, be. compared to like Wisconsin or yeah. Texas, which <laughs> Wisconsin. is so random. It's actually true though. I was in Wisconsin literally on Wednesday. Oh, every really? day. Yes. <laughs> It was so cheap. Like I literally got like a full on salad and it was like $5. If I got a salad at like Whole Foods, it would be like 23. 15. <laughs> literally. Can I get a coupon for that? <laughs> but um, it's cheaper than Hawaii. It's a little bit cheaper than New York, but it's expensive. Expensive? It's, it's more expensive than most places. What's the first thing you notice about the people in LA compared to where you came from? Came that's from? so different because we all Oh came my God, from that's so true. Yeah. Okay, okay, go first. I moved here from Turkey and there. I know, I watched your whole moving to LA videos, all of those. Okay, anyways, go on. Oh my god, I've never been so honored. honored. So there, YouTube is not a thing. Social media is not a thing. Like <laughs> me doing that there, people were like, what the f Moving here, everyone's doing what I was doing and I felt like I belonged here. And here everyone's like has such a hard like drive. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So like, I was like, it's my time to shine. And then, Aww. yeah. Mm -hmm. And now you're shining. So I'm from Hawaii, I'm from Maui. Everyone is just super duper chill. So like, we just go surf, you just go hang out, you go to school. Wow. And then uh, oh most my. kids just kind of like, they either go to college in like California or they just like- Be a surf. Yeah, like Dude. forever. And it's just like super chill. Whereas here, everyone, as you said, is like super like inspired and going and getting what they want. So like, I kind of like was craving that and I just needed to get out and like go and do something. And here there's just like a lot more opportunity for that. I'm from Texas and I feel like at least the part where I grew up, like my town, a lot of people were very, like they had their same stuff that they do. Like mm -hmm. everyone grows up, they go to college, they either come back or they just get married and then they have kids. And like, I don't, it's like, yeah, they just have a set like thing. Yeah. And so yeah, like you're born knowing how you're going to die. <laughs> and that's so Whoa. depressing. <laughs> yeah. <Jesus> Haley. <laughs> Yeah, so it was just like- I was just thinking. So like, old age, I'll take that one. <laughs> and I feel like a lot, so like everyone, I feel like it's very similar in Texas. And so to be a YouTuber and to be like different, it was just kind of like a little struggle. So coming out here was cool because like, it's like you said, it's like all your people, you can shine. None of us like were born in LA and like we're born into a community like this. Mm -hmm. We kind of like found our place here, which like says a lot about like, like LA and like how yeah. people attract to mm -hmm. it. That's so I crazy. think it's like super cool that we all were just kind of like, little beans out in and the then pod. we just kind of like, like, like yeah like, like i'm from turkey you're from hawaii like, like from why are you sitting on my bed right now <laughs> that's a really good question what are your thoughts about people especially instagram influencers and people in la you'll go to events and like people like you know that person knows who you are because they like either liked your picture before like commented or, or like met them or you've met them and they'll literally act like they don't know you and like they've never seen or they'll you. act like better than you oh they're act like oh they're like, oh, who are you? Oh, you'll be like, hey, like, remember we met at like, I don't know, beauty con. And they'll be like, oh, we did. And you're like, do you remember lack brain cells? Oh, or like, I, I, nev I will never forget people. No, ever. even if I meet like a subscriber and then I yeah. go to another event, I'm like, oh my goodness. It's not like, you don't just like forget people. Yeah. I feel like it's the people who are insecure about their videos or like they're insecure about themselves who like act. find themselves like trying to like act like they Don't. are like above you just because they have more followers or because they're working with so-and-so or whatever it is. Yeah. And that stems from their own insecurities, but you can tell as an outsider or from the person that they're acting rude to. Like if you're just like standing there and they're just like looking up and down at you and you're just like, yeah, well, what? Like, yeah, okay, I'm confident. I like what I'm wearing. I like what I'm doing with my life. If you want to look at me like that, like, okay, but like. Yeah. I don't understand why people just can't be nice. Like, that's what I try. Like, I know. every freaking interaction I have, it's just like to like give kindness. And I don't understand like how other people will like purposely be mean. Be mean. Like, what and, do like, you get out like, of like, that? Like, yeah, literally, what do you like? And then oh, in their I'm videos, cool for two seconds. they're like, oh my God, I love all of you guys so <laughs> much. so much. How to deal with fake people and fake friends in LA. I don't deal with them. I don't associate with them. I don't know them. The moment but, you like realize that someone's either trying to use you for your followers or use you for whatever it is, like I feel like all three of us have come to a realization like you just kind of like drift away. Like, okay, like, okay. I just think it's like important to find the people that friends yeah. that like it's not just like about going to parties or going to things with and like 
putting up a front and like it's all about like the social media and like oh like blah 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 it's like just like chilling just, like, like, or, like fun like out. having a good time like, yeah it's good to find people who you can be a hundred percent yourself around i like to find friends that aren't even in the social media yeah. realm yeah. just so like i have that good ba balance where like sometimes i'm in this world mm -hmm. and like but the thing is like with my social media friends i can step into the real world and mm -hmm. with my real friends i can bring them into the social media world yes and yes. find this like beautiful balance where i'm just in the middle and like really happy mm -hmm. because like some people just like are so like buried deep in that social media realm. Like, like they're, they're like, not even living. They're like, they're that's not all they're thinking. Like everything like, they're they not think is like people. for the purpose of social media. It's like they want to take a Snapchat. They're trying so hard to take a Snapchat that they look like they're having fun. That like, but they're not, they're not, not like, even fun. Yeah. And that's like, I've definitely had to like find the balance with those people. And it's funny because like, well. I'll talk to other people's managers and they'd be like, yeah, like I made them a squad and like, really? Thank you so much for watching this video. Like I said, make sure you watch Tati's and Olivia's video. Oh. We answer some like juicy questions on there too. Oh, really juicy. juicy. Subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so much. All the way to Pluto and back. Woo! Bye! Bye. Talking in my sleep at night, making my